Now let's talk about Africa's greatest digital success story, mobile money. This is where the irony gets almost painful. Kenya's M-Pesa disrupted digital payments for the entire world. Today, Sub-Saharan Africa processes more mobile money transactions than all other regions combined. African innovation at its finest, right? But here is the catch. The infrastructure enabling these African mobile payments is overwhelmingly foreign-owned. We've created this bizarre situation where African innovation runs on foreign infrastructure, generating massive profits that flow back to shareholders in European nations, not to the African communities that pioneered these technologies. Within 18 months, Starlink was operational in over 16 African countries, bypassing decades of building local infrastructure with space-based technology. African telecom operators who spend billions building networks are now watching American satellites steal their customers. And there's almost nothing they can do about it. You can't exactly regulate space. Starlink creates jobs in California and pays taxes to the American government while extracting subscription fees from African users. Its extraction without investment is the perfect colonial model updated for the digital age. 